Hey guys, this is Shannon with Nearly Organic Noshing. Um, I have been on vacation for about four days and I came home to my pumpkin patch looking like this. Um, it was late last night when I came out and it was dark and I really couldn't see anything and I thought maybe I had gotten the like the squash bugs or the borers that I've seen that have gotten into the vines and I came out this morning and I slid a couple of the vines open trying to look to see um, if I could find them and I couldn't find anything in the vines but what I did find on the back side of the leaves if you can see this I don't know if it's focusing in are these little tiny green worms and I I don't know what they are um, I don't I guess it's a some other sort of a squash bug um, but it has completely come in and just decimated um, my squash, my, my giant pumpkin patch. And it's also gotten into my, um, pie pumpkins over here. So it's looking really rough. It, it got into these over here, which this is really wilted because it's in the, um, high nineties right now. And it's, uh, it's, you know, around lunchtime or so it's like 1245, so I have, um, I just ordered some neem oil and Dr. Bronner's soap because I had been using some organic um, worry-free spray that you just hooked onto your garden nozzle and sprayed and I've been treating it with that but apparently that is not touching it. So um, I have something else here that I'm going to try and use and, and treat it again while I'm waiting for the neem oil and the Dr. Bronner's soap to come in. If anybody... Um, knows of anything else that would work better than than what I'm using I would appreciate it um, I'm gonna go in and do some research to see if I can figure out what these little tiny green worms are because honestly I just don't know I'm assuming it's some sort of a squash bug um, but if anybody else knows and wants to uh, send me a comment and let me know if there's another treatment option I should be aware of I would appreciate it because that's the main stems that are going out to these big pumpkins that are are dead. So I don't know if they're just going to finish ripening in the sun or if um, if they're just going to die off and not ripen. So uh, I would appreciate any information. Thanks so much. Hope you guys are having a great day.